Our coverage continues tonight as Greenville is the host to the NCAA Regional Tournament. It's an exciting time for Pirate fans all across the East. Nine on your signs, Dominique Moody joins us now from inside Clark LeClaire Stadium. Dominique, what can you tell us about the energy there? I'm sure you can feel it. Shayla, pure joy. That's the best way to describe the emotions of the fans, the coaches, and the players. And tonight is definitely a great night to be a pirate, especially after a late night win. From the bright lights to the tailgates. It's absolutely amazing. Nothing is better than pirate baseball, especially when the pirates are on the road to a championship. Greenville, North Carolina is definitely a baseball town. This place will be rocking, I'm sure. Even for former baseball player Corey Thompson, this moment means everything to the team in purple and gold. But to reach Omaha, the Pirates need some help from Pirate Nation. Now we got to do our job here, you know what I mean? And we have opportunity to do it. And the energy throughout it all, simply exhilarating. I think it's fantastic for the university, for the fan base, packed house. You can see the emotions and the fans. There is one catalyst for all the traffic. A driver for economic development. And it's at the University Book Exchange where that is making a difference. A steady stream of customers coming in, asking about our uh, championship t-shirts we just received in today. Um, baseball merchandise, baseball caps. T-shirts, hats, jerseys, and more, all to help shower support for the boys in the East. And the Pirates did go on to win. They won 16 to 7, beating the Seahawks. And what also we're going to be doing is we're going to be bringing you coverage throughout the rest of the night in sports. Our Zach Masovich and Brian Bailey will bring you the latest. But for now, we're going to send it back to you in the studio. Dominique Moody, now on your side.